our continuing coverage of back to school this morning. It's been more than a month since students returned to school amid the pandemic. Josh Navarro is live at the Honeyway Falls Lima Middle School today, where technology is really making a difference there. Josh, good morning. Good morning to you, Mark. In the past, we reported that a hybrid model will be used here in the school district, and we popped into one of the classrooms, and it looks pretty neat, and teachers tell me it's going pretty well so far this school year. Students at home are attending classes live via Zoom, just like if they were attending school in person. Students are also using Windows Microsoft class notebooks and Schoology apps for assignments. School officials say this, uh, this synchronized learning opportunity benefits remote learners because they won't miss any any instruction while at home. This type of technology was part of the district's 2020 vision plans to move the district forward in education. But ironically, the pandemic hit this year and they were already prepared to roll out their plans. It's definitely going to have an impact on their learning. They're not going to learn as much material this year as you know as we would use, learn in, in um, your average year. But teachers are really focusing on the essential skills focusing on the most important things and making sure students are getting that before they move forward. And school officials say they're always looking for better ways to help teachers and students under these circumstances, saying that they're constantly reevaluating and making changes accordingly. For now, we're live in Honeyoy Falls this morning. I'm Josh Navarro, News 8. Josh, thank you. For more on synchronized learning and other schools with hybrid models of learning, head to rochesterfirst.com.